welcome back. In honor of Older Americans Month, we are celebrating with Cox Communications, and we have Rylan Madison, the California Director of Product Marketing, to show us how older Americans can age in place, age at home, and really just a whole new level of smart tech that allows us to be smarter too. Yes, <laughs> um, and you know, aging at home is so important because as human beings, we want to be able to stay where we've grown up. I've been in my house for over two decades, mm -hmm. and I have friends and neighbors mm -hmm. and family members all around me, and you know, th that would be a huge disruption to me if I had to move yeah. um, as I get older. So technology has allowed us to stay where we're at, aging in place, mm -hmm. um, both for the individual as well as the caregiver. That's tremendous, and you've brought us a whole array. I didn't even know this stuff existed. So and, and more coming every day. That's so tremendous. So start us, start us at that end. Tell us what we're looking at. So here we have um, thermostat. Mm -hmm. So uh, you can control your home uh, air conditioning, heating. Um, also, by having that control, helps you to actually save some dollars as well. Sure. Uh, especially as you know, summer months come up. How does um, that work exactly? What does the little device do? So, so this uh, replaces your thermostat, so okay. it's a smart thermostat. Okay. Um, and it also works through an application. Mm -hmm. It can work through this touch screen as well. Um, and so that way, in your house, you can use the touch screen. If you happen to leave and forget to you know, turn up your thermostat during the summer months uh, so you can save some dollars, you can do that through your smartphone through your really phone. easily. Oh, that's yeah. so great. Really easily. And then it also works with, uh, we've got cameras and door locks, uh, smoke detector, and uh, also detects uh, carbon monoxide. Wow. So that all ties together, and you can do that all from the touch screen if you're in the house. Yes. Or you can do it from the same app. It's just one app, right? Correct. On your phone? Yeah. And even sometimes, you know, I might be on the sofa and get a little lazy. And, uh, <laughs> yeah. no. Nowadays, our smartphone is always in it our is. pocket. It's not very it far is. away. It is. No, it most is. of the time it's the TV remote. So, yeah, it's right there with you. I get it. Yeah. But not just security, but also surveillance. And, you know, I have a friend, um, and his mother, unfortunately, has Alzheimer's. Mm -hmm. And he works, and this gives him peace of mind because when he leaves his house, he has uh, it set that if the front door opens, he gets a message. Oh. Um, mm -hmm. He had a scary incident recently before he installed the system um, where his mother left his house, and fortunately, his uh, neighbors were there okay. and were able to stop his mother from mm -hmm. wandering off. I think we all know stories like that. So anything that makes it easier to monitor and keep people safe, that's, that's huge. Exactly. Show us the lock. You were talking about how your son really likes the lock, and I think <laughs> the lock is a genius idea. Yeah, so um, my son uh, is 13. Um, a minimalist and he doesn't <laughs> like to carry keys around. Smart um, kid, yeah. So this is also good too because I'm a bit absent-minded. Um, so you can have a traditional key but you can also enter in key code. Mm -hmm. um, so he has his own key code. You could also enter in a different key code for a house uh, keeper mm -hmm. um, or a caregiver um, if you have someone checking on uh, your parent who might be living with you and that way if that caregiver changes yep. you don't have to worry about getting the key back or, or changing having everybody's change. codes exactly you, just, you can change that one code that's, if yeah, you want. that's yeah. really great that's um, super smart i've also set up um a, a rule and they're really easy to do so um you know i want to make sure my son is safe so i have a rule set that monday through friday um, if the front door doesn't open between 3 p.m. and 4.30 p.m., send me a text message. Oh. Mm. That means my son hasn't gotten safely home from school. And then you can check in with him. Exactly. So mm -hmm. smart. So let's, let's skip the kitty, mm. <laughs> and we'll come back to kitty. Maybe we'll come down okay. to this end, and we'll come back to All kitty, because right. okay. kitty's kind of a highlight. Yes. Yeah. yes. So tell us about the lamp. Yes, so that also works with home life, mm -hmm. um, and that not only the convenience of being able to turn uh, lights on and off, but when you're not home, it makes you appear that you're home, so kind of that extra security. Mm -hmm. 
Um, and you can turn it on and off from the app, so it's not that you've turned it on in the morning and left it on all day. Correct. Mm -hmm. Right. And okay. you can also Smart. set it to, you know, turn on at sunset, mm -hmm. and turn off so many hours or randomly so many hours after that. But also if you're a caregiver, maybe you want to turn on some lights and illuminate the house for, you know, uh, elderly parents. Mm -hmm. Sure. That's, Terrific. That's great. And the phone, which I love. My grandmother had a phone like this mm -hmm. with the big, the with the big, big buttons. buttons. The big buttons. It's easy to see. Also, you can adjust the volume. Mm -hmm. So it's, you know, if you, you're a little bit hard of hearing, um, you can hear the other person on the other side very clearly. Super smart. And in front we have what looks like a blood pressure, uh, what's it called? Band? Yes, um, so a blood pressure monitor, you can put that on and you can securely send the information to your doctor. Oh, we know wow. that telemedicine is a big thing now. Mm -hmm. And so that's a huge convenience because now you don't have to leave the comfort of your home. And it's not just leaving the comfort, but we know that doctors are always on time. Yeah, yeah. You mm -hmm. get there and you're in the waiting room and you're waiting mm -hmm. and you're waiting. Right. And then also, um, especially if folks can't drive, mm -hmm. Um, you know, or they don't want to drive, you know, again, the convenience of right from your home, when the doctor gets um, the readings, they can call you back and let you know, um, you know, how you're doing, or if you really do need to come in or sure. not. Sure, mm, that's, that's, that's great. So smart. This one I love, this one I think I need. <laughs> so this is totally the, did I remember to take my supplements today? So whether it's yeah. medication or supplements, it's all good, right? Yes. Everybody needs a reminder. How does this work? Yes, so um, this is a pill box. You fill it up uh, once a week, optimally. And what it does is it'll send you an alert, a reminder to take your pills or that you haven't taken your pills, mm -hmm. more importantly. And you can set up reminders. So if you have a caregiver, mm -hmm. if you have um, a son or a daughter, um, they can also, also have that comfort mm -hmm. that they know or they get the alert and they can call you up and say, hey mom, hey dad. You Did know, you forget? Did you, you forget, forget your pills again? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, yeah, so. that's really interesting. And it's interesting. so easy to do that, right? Well, it looks, and, it's, and it's so easy. You just, you know, it is right easy. Out. Do that. This right here. And then it's, so it's chipped, and it reports into the app as well. Correct. Got so it. yeah, it's that easy. You load it up, and then throughout the week, when you take your medicine, you open it up and then it registers that you've opened it up. And it's Very even easy. kind of pretty, which you know, I'm all about yeah, the pretty. It, I know you are. <laughs> it is, it, and it looks nice. So Fido, Fido gets part of this too, because we might forget to feed the poor guy, right? Yes, <laughs> um, Odie or Garfield, okay. <laughs> whether you're a dog or a cat exactly. person. Exactly. Um, and you basically set this, um, you can set it different times a day to uh, feed again, mm -hmm. either you're a canine or feline. Sure. Um, that way you don't forget. Does it work for kids? <laughs> it's a really good idea. Yeah. Cheerios. You only get this the Cheerios. Cheerios and goldfish. <laughs> Cheerios and goldfish. That sounds like a plan. Oh. Now let's talk about kitty, pretty kitty here, because this one is pretty remarkable. Yes. So in, in the instance where you cannot have a pet, um, maybe it's a little too much to upkeep, or you're allergic. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. A lot of people are, are allergic um, to dog or cat fur. Or sometimes a location doesn't allow. Yeah, so yeah. That's right. exactly. That's right. um, so this is the next best thing. So the cat actually um, provides feedback. She purrs. What? I don't know if you heard that. I did hear and that. And she also and responds. Um, and, you know, doctors, psychologists have shown that, um, you know, this gives you comfort, gives you peace. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. um, and, you know, a lot of times when we're retired and we're sitting at home, we have a lot of downtime. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, and there's only so many books we can read. Mm -hmm. That's true. Um, and this gives you companionship. Well, um, you mentioned also that, that Alzheimer's patients are actually responding to it. Yes. So there has been a study shown, um, and there's actually a golden retriever puppy version of this. Um, I think I and, would love that. And, yeah. I'll, you know, they've taken into hospitals and Alzheimer's uh, patients actually respond and they start responding. There she goes. See, I'm not petting her enough. Yeah, oh, that's right. She, she's asking for she's more. She's asking for See? attention. Yes. Yeah. That's yeah, a needy kitty. 
needy kitty. <laughs> Pretty needy kitty. But these are all remarkable. And what a great, oh wait, this one we missed. I thought this was your house key set, but of course you don't have house keys. You have a, you you have have a, code. You have a smart lock. So talk so again, about this. So this. This, is, um, this is a device, it's called Tile. And actually you can place it on um, keys, mm -hmm. um, things that you're likely to lose. Right. So if you do have keys, in this case we have keys to the car, um, we, we can have an app. Um, of course you have to remember where your phone is. Yeah. Um, and it will ring this for you. Um, so you can locate where it is. Also the app will show you uh -huh. where it is so you can walk to it. And then if you happen to find this and misplace your phone, you can press the center of the tile and it'll, and it'll ring your phone. Show your phone. So, so I have tile in my suitcases yes. because I travel a ridiculous amount. The suitcases oh, I purchased came with a free tile yeah. and you put the tile inside the suitcase because of my things that are going to get lost, notoriously, it'll be a suitcase. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And that way my phone can actually show the airport where my suitcase is. Oh, that's is. brilliant. Yeah, so, so there are so that. many applications for that. I didn't realize that that was what that is. Let's I say I it. wanted to get this situation over here, which I do. How would I go about doing that? Um, so with the home life, um, you would give Cox Communications a call. Uh -huh. um, we actually <coughs> have uh, two different uh, service levels. Mm -hmm. So we have... Um, security uh, uh, level and uh, that provides uh, door alarms, um, what have you, as well as the cameras, uh, door locks, um, smoke detectors. But if you already have a security system and maybe so you just want the surveillance piece, mm -hmm. you want to be able to check in on Again, if you're a caregiver, or if you have children, or if you have pets, mm -hmm. um, we have another level that's just a surveillance level, okay. um, so that you don't, if you don't want that 24/7 uh, monitoring as mm. well. So. And then, are all of these available through Cox, or you're simply you're promoting all of the smart tech, so people would be able to find it through you? So, so no, so some of this stuff is, is not available, but it's more of what you can do. And of course, mm -hmm. the thing that powers all of this is having an internet connection into your home. Sure. Right. Um, and you know, with Cox Communications, we have Cox Internet. Um, and being able to have a connected home allows for this. And there's more technology coming every day. Mm -hmm. And you know, for example, every day in the United States, 10,000 people become 65 years old every day. Wow. And by 2030, one in every five people will be 65 or older. Wow. So, you know, it, this is... Ten this years is, away. I, you know, I, I resemble that remark. <laughs> <laughs> um, and, you know, this, this really allows you, I can't emphasize enough, to age in place and give that peace of mind, not only for that, that person to stay in that home where mm -hmm. they've lived in for so many years, right. but also their caretaker, mm -hmm. their, you know, their children who are likely watching after them, you know, giving them that peace of mind mm -hmm. that their parents are safe. So the website is? www.cox.com. Cox.com. Cox.com. Okay. Cox Cox Thank you, Ryland. Thank you so much for sharing all of this. This is enlightening, and I know our viewers are just going to be looking for it. So we appreciate you coming in. Thank, Thank you, ladies. Thank you. And we'll be right back. Mm -hmm.